Well, the role of the media in society in recent years has uh, been undergoing really a, a complete transformation. Uh, and we're, uh, a lot of scholars are looking at it as that we continue to really be in the early phases of uh, uh, what can be thought of as a, really a revolution of sorts. In fact, people use the term the digital revolution. And um, depending on where you want to date that, uh, it could be when Al Gore invented the internet. Uh, or sometime thereafter when the internet became ubiquitous in American society or when uh, that started to result in a significant decline that continues to this day in the economic fortunes of traditional news media, newspapers, radio, television. Uh, but all of that taken together has uh, undermined the traditional economic model for delivering news in society and thereby it has uh, created a disruption in really in our democracy because the, um, the news media has always been thought of as the fourth estate as a an institution like an actual institution no less so than government itself uh, that plays this vital role of contributing to having an informed electorate to make smart decisions about how to govern ourselves as a representative democracy. Um, and it's not as though that's like going away or that we're in some type of crisis necessarily, but there is a recognition that um, that's been disrupted. And we as a society are in the process of figuring out what comes next there. Has news writing changed as a result of the, the transformations that are going on in the um, news business and in society in general, I don't think it's changed all that much. I think the fundamentals of good news writing remain the same. Uh, I think that audiences recognize when something is uh, fundamentally unobjective. There still does remain a fundamental, I believe, uh, dynamic in uh, audiences where the majority of people are seeking accurate, objective representations of reality uh, on any given day. I believe the inverted pyramid style is not dead. The, the structure of storytelling is something that is directly related to the, the human brain and how we process information. Uh, the inverted pyramid is something that evolved uh, in journalism uh, to, to plug into that. And it works. Um, people want the most basic who, what, when, where, why at the very top, and then, you know, for, for the facts to proceed from there. With all of the channels distracting people um, and all the drinking from the fire hose that goes on, um, more than ever, people want you to get to the point right away and get, get me the who, what, when, where, why now immediately in 140 characters or less, preferably. And then if I want more, I know where I can go find it. That, I think that's, that's how audiences approach things. So no, the inverted pyramid style is, is, uh, is not dead. It's, it's very much alive and well.